Alrighty, this is a video response to Andy24DB's 100 subscriber contest. Andy, congratulations. Way to go on your 100 subs. Uh, if you don't know who Andy is, go check him out. If you're into sort of, uh, like, man, if you like Tangerine Dream and you're not subscribed to his channel, I don't know what you're doing. Um, but his contest is just show, you know, the worst record. I got a few. I got a few to show you. Um, it's funny because at the beginning of October, we sort of did like a big record purge. And um, uh, for Record Fest, I was selling a bunch of records. So I got a bunch of stuff that I really don't listen to. And uh, honestly, that's what sold at, <laughs> at Record Fest. I had a ton of belly dancer music. Um, was kind of, I went through a phase where I was like listening to a lot of like Middle Eastern 60s stuff. Um, you know, if it had the fuzz guitar on it, I, I kept it, but if it didn't, I got rid of it. And a lot of people bought it, so, ugh, I don't know. So I'm going to show a couple records, and ah, darn you, Teddy. Teddy beat me to the punch on this one, but I'm going to still show it because it is just a horrible record. This is a, this is a, you know, driving in a convertible stuck behind a garbage truck on a 90 degree day. Horrible. Uh, Terry Bradshaw, Until You. It's like, basically, it's country, it's a Christian record. And Terry Bradshaw. I mean, do you need a fourth thing? I don't think you do. I think you know, it's this thing was destined for failure from day one, or you know, the word go. I guess I love on the back the liner notes, Jojo Bradshaw, uh, which is I, I'm assuming his wife. I don't know if it's still his wife or if he's still married or but I, I I think he had several. Uh, you know, from being from Pittsburgh, I should probably know this because you know, Terry Bradshaw is sort of a uh, you know one of the sacred cows around here. You know. Got us all some some uh, you know Super Bowl championships, but th the notes on the back are just fantastic. Just Terry Bradshaw is a big, strong, aggressive, determined man. He is able to withstand incredible pressure and criticism and still come out shining. <laughs> and then down here, it's like in living with Terry, I've seen both sides of him as he praises God in both victories as well as tribulations. I hope you enjoy getting to know this other dimension that you don't see in the football uniform and that his music brings you joy. Jojo Bradshaw is just horrible. This is just a horrible record. Um, here's something else. This is, I found this at a thrift store and I still have it. I can't really pull myself to get rid of it, but it's bad. Again, another, another kind of country record. This is, uh, this is a John Schneider <laughs> solo album. Uh, if you know who John Schneider is, he was... Uh, was he Bo Duke or Luke Duke? I can't remember. I used to watch the Dukes of Hazard all the time, but he was uh, on the TV show The Dukes of Hazard. He was one of the brothers. Uh, this one, this one that happens to be autographed by John Schneider. I could not, you know, I couldn't pass that up. You know, you you throw this at me at a thrift store, I will pass it up. But uh, I think I listened to it maybe one time, and I was like, wow, this is bad. This is really, really bad. So, um, just you know, kind of, just just not. Just not good at all. I was trying to see if there's anything in here that kind of jumped out at me, but no. I've had this record for a very, very long time, though. I've probably had it for about, you know, 12 years or so. It was one of the first records I ever picked up. Um, uh, these ones come out of Sam's collection. So, uh, William Shatner, The Transformed Man. I can't, I don't know which way to take this record. If, I don't know if William Shatner is being serious here. He does a cover of Lucy in the Sky with Diamonds and uh, Mr. Tambourine Man. And, I mean... What it says is William Shatner as an actor, you know, and it's just, I mean, it's good. It, it's good in that aspect, but I don't know which way to take this, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to throw this one in here, but this is just, you know, Bob Dylan, you know, I always joke about it. I say, Bob Dylan's rolling in his grave, which he's not dead, but, you know, he would be if he heard this, I'm sure, if he had not, hasn't already. Um, oh, and another one, too. Like, how can I forget this one? Here's the... Uh, <laughs> it's the touch of Leonard Nimoy. So again, don't let me don't tell Sam I showed these because she loves she loves the old Star Trek. Um, does a cover of uh, Randy Newman's. Uh, I think it's gonna rain today. Just really, really, really ridiculous stuff. So uh, and then last but not least, just like a weird like who who would buy this? Who the heck would buy this? Tune your auto harp. Who the heck is this appeal to? I mean, this is just, you know, you can't really listen to this record. It's a, you know, I don't know. Anyhow, um, 
yeah, congratulations, Andy. So we'll see you later.